Now you've just arrived in Paris, first Diamond League meet of your career tomorrow. Excited? Yeah, mate, definitely. Um, coming in, driving past the Eiffel Tower, um, seeing all the athletes and stuff in the hotels. Good. Looking forward to it. Hoping to cause a few upsets, mate. Yeah, well, it's obviously been going well. You've probably got the longest uh, unbeaten run out of any British athlete this season. I think you're at nine now. Uh, Sainsbury's British champion last weekend. Confidence must be sky high. Yeah, definitely. Um, I'm running pretty well. Um, enjoying my races, just running my own race, and kind of like you say, being unbeaten is pretty cool. Whether I can carry that on, I don't know. But no, I'm hoping to just do my thing again tomorrow. See what I can do. Run a good time and see what see what happens. Basically. And this year, massive breakthrough. Kind of, can you put your finger on what's caused such a big leap in your performances? Um, just kind of consistent training over the last few years, like um, staying injury free, touch wood. Um, just kind of being able to put sessions back to back, um, staying healthy, and just every little thing like nutrition and everything like that. Just looking at it more closely and focusing on the little things has helped massively, I think. And you seem to have a great training group, obviously. Uh, the National Performance Institute in Loughborough under Nick Dakin, your training partner Tom Burton got second and booked his spot on the uh, European Championship team as well. You've got obviously Megan in the women's event. You must be working what you're doing. Yeah, definitely. Uh, it's nice to, nice to see people kind of showing that the programme works and Nick getting the credit that he deserves kind of thing from outside. Um, and obviously the setup, setup in Loughborough couldn't be better, really. Um, and yeah, there's plenty others in the group who could be performing great and it's just not quite clicking just yet, so hopefully a few more of the guys will come out this year and run quick as well. And talk of running quick, kind of how quick do you think you can go tomorrow night? I don't know, I don't want to put a time on it. Um, I'm happy with what I've run this year, if I can just be consistent like I have been, just keep going, keep doing my own thing and if I can chase down some of the big guys and run a bit quicker then that'll be brilliant, but I'm not going to kind of put a time on it, just, just happy to be running quick basically. And uh, next stop, Sainsbury's Glasgow Grand Prix. How excited are you to compete again in front of a big home crowd? Oh, that'll be that'll be pretty sick. Uh, and obviously another Diamond League. It'll be another high quality race uh, after tomorrow. So yeah, I mean the crowd will be awesome. Uh, should be a sellout. New track. So yeah, all points to being another quick race. So it should be good. Yeah.